Baja California is one of our favorite places to go in our camper van. In today's video, we show a day in the life in Baja California. and Robin. And these are our midlife adventures. Living in and out of our midlife van. After a great time at Playa El Recrozon, we headed further north just about 30 minutes to stop at Playa Los Cocos one more time before heading back across the border. Well, we have made it to Los Cocos before it got dark tonight. And quick little half hour drive from Playa Los Cocos. We are nose first this time, but got the view, got the palapa, and going to cook some shrimp for dinner and enjoy the night. Sin jalapeno. No. <laughs> That's why he's struggling. <laughs> 30 pesos for a cinnamon roll and 30 pesos for a roll, huh? Now we got bread for breakfast and lunch tomorrow. So we yes. just chatted with the neighborhood peeps yes. here at Cocos. Had Always a great nice. evening. Always and now, I don't think there's a moon tonight, but the stars are starting to, They're starting to pop. pop. <laughs> and tomorrow's supposed to be a calm day, so we are going to get out there. Go kayaking. And snorkeling, too. I think you need to snorkel. Mm. We'll get you over there. There's I think some really Rich good needs fish. to snorkel and Robin needs to relax. relax. Or, you know what, Robin? You need to do some videos. <laughs> <laughs> need to get this video posted. Get them up there. Okay. Get them up there. Throw okay. them up there. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Rich heated up his cinnamon roll this morning for breakfast. I made smoothies and now he is putting together a kayak for an adventure. Dose. All put together? See. Bye, Playa Los Cocos. We are going to head to El Burro. Going over the rock that we see at uh, low tide. Uh -huh. It's pretty far down there, too. High tide was at what, six? High tide was this morning at six. Yeah. yeah. And we are going to head around the corner to El Burro. That was some cool baby fish there. Lots of schools of minnows and sergeant majors, little babies. Now let's head to Bird Rock. Bird Rock is barely out of the water, and currently I see one bird. So many little baby fish down there. Down there, down there. Do you see a lot of fish out there, Rich? I see a lot of little guys, and see some sergeant majors. It just seems like there's like nothing for a while, and then all of a sudden they just come flying in. Beautiful day, Rich. Yes, it is. Let's, the water is calm. Let's go see. Oh, the one bird's gone from Bird Rock. Let's go to El Burro. Maybe the bird will come back. Thank you for 
rock formation? What kind of rock do you suppose that is, Nick? Yeah, good question. We got a bird with some fish in his mouth and the other birds are trying to take it from him. That's not cool. Let's see if we can find some fishies. Got a little yeah, a little skirt, yeah. yeah. But I think that's mostly like a coral buildup, kind of. Oh, I thought it was more of a rock. Is the minnow a type of fish or just a little fish called minnow? I, I think there's minnows. These are all baby fish major. Yeah. Jack. It's pretty cool, it's like a little shelf here. Yeah. yeah. Ooh, there's another big guy right there. Mm -hmm. Probably. <laughs> Rich, where'd we get to here? We got to Belboro. Lots of paddle boarders out today because it's so calm. Let's check out the coffee shop. Uh, cervezas, margaritas and coffee. NFL on Sunday. a little of El Burro that went to the nomadic coffee shop. They have a nice little brunch and breakfast menu that's Tel Pai. And there's a sports bar next door that says it has Sunday night football. Sunday afternoon probably, huh? Yeah. Sunday football. And it's a sports bar. Now we're gonna go check out the tent camping here on the beach. That's called glamping. And then there's one across the road. That's called glamping. That's <laughs> called Baja glamping. <laughs> so all these are residents. Yeah. So how much do you suppose they sell for when people do turnover rich? How much would you spend on a shack on the beach? Well, I mean, you've got to look inside. I don't know what the yeah. inside sits. I mean, I don't would know. you rather just build up a palapa and utilities? park your van next to it? Yeah. I don't think there's utilities here, Rich. Well, I mean... Yeah. How much would you spend for a shack on the beach in Baja? Interesting to see what it looks like inside. Uh, probably about the same as it looks on the outside. Piece mealed together. Start off with something and then build more. Yeah. I'm assuming all these with the plywood fronts are plywood currently fronts. not in, you know, they're pot, boarded them up to go home and then yeah. they'll unboard them when they come back. If those darn jake brakes weren't a, <laughs> such a problem here, on our next video, on our next trip, when we search for properties in Baja, Should we 
by something in Baja. How much would you spend for that second one on the left, Rich? If if the trailer in Las Brillas is 89 with no view. <laughs> but you get electricity. Yeah. Sewer. Yeah. Water. You get a palapa with windows, Rich. <laughs> So I see the tents back there. There's some structures. See it? Yeah, it's a variety of things. Though. Yeah. It's like the ones, there's a couple little. Yeah. And then there's tents right here on the waterfront. So that's probably the spot back there. Another restaurant? Yeah, another restaurant and bar. And then there's the baños, the green building. Yeah. Not the fanciest baños. Is the clam guy here? <laughs> Compressed. What's it called? MD, like MD? It's not even solid wood. Yeah. Kayaks for rent. Is this their the camping when you pay to camp? Maybe these two down here. Okay. Let's go check out this little beach over here and we'll go to the corner here. Palapa? Okay. Oh, and you? Uh, we're, we're around the, the side over. Around the corner, of Cocos. Oh. But do they rent these here or? No, no, this is our house. I yeah. Just, okay. Yeah, we just got back last night after being away for a while. Wow. Mm. So. Are there any for sale? Uh, you know, you better have the cappuccino. Okay. Because I just got back. Yeah, right, right. Uh -huh. I don't know much what's going on. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, but uh, I'm pretty sure there's something might be for sale. Yeah. But no electricity, right? No, it's all upgrade. There is yeah. no, no electricity, nothing. You know. Right. I mean, just bring in. Have a little system together. Yeah. Just bring in water and. Yes. Yeah. What do you yeah, do for uh, what do you do for soup? Internet and what do you do for uh, wastewater? Uh, we have a tank. Okay. Yeah, we got bougainvillea that really like it. Uh -huh. oh, okay. So, you can get composting it's toilet. Kind of dead now, but I hope it will come back. Yeah. yeah right. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. Yeah, you're yep. welcome, guys. You too. Little beach, Rich. Wonder how far out the low tide goes. Baby Beach. And there's El Burro. There's El Coyote, Rich. Yep. 
Yeah. Yeah. Lots of people there. Yeah, it was pretty packed when we drove by. I think uh, some of the long-term people are already here down there. They wanted to get their spot at El Coyote before it got too busy. This is the island here, and then the Coyote Island's behind it. If you haven't seen our video where we kayaked out to El Coyote Island, check it out right here. <laughs> now we can see Cocos. And we're getting closer. Not sure what the name of this little island is. We've gone over two miles? Yes, we've gone over two miles. See some fish jumping out there. Lots of birds fishing, that's for sure. See tons of, to the left of the island, to the right of the island, tons of birds fishing and splashing away. Over two miles, and we are almost at the little isle. Beautiful day in Bahia Conception. All the birds are fishing over here. All the big birds. The big pelicanos. They're all just hanging out over here. Today. Are we invading this big old bird island? Go to the beach. We can stretch our legs. Yeah. We can go for a swim too. We could go for a swim. Great spot to stop and rest up. A Yes, get those legs. Time to head back and have some lunch. Still great conditions. This should be an easy paddle. This should be an easy paddle back, huh? We've gone 2.8. opposite direction of the wind, they're kind of fighting each other a little bit. The wind in our face, the current at our side. There is El Burro again. And straight ahead, Cocos! 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 Straight ahead to the van, Rich! to the van so clear over here and what's so funny is there's like no grass in the water here at all yeah, and a year and a half ago in March there was so much grass and even last March there was beginning of March their grass was starting to grow a lot land ho yeah. you think we're gonna make it Robin I think we're gonna make it rich I think we will So over four miles. Yep. Four point one. Four point oh six. Well, <laughs> well we're, we're almost there, so almost. we'll call it four point one. I'd say yes.
After a nice long kayak, we spent the rest of the afternoon enjoying the views of Coco's and visiting with our Coco's neighbors. Robin, what you making? Got some zucchini going. I know I said you're going to have a salad, but tomorrow. Zucchini's good. I like zucchini. And then we're going to make some shrimp. And, what and you else? want your shrimp in a tortilla? Yeah. Do and we have harina? Yes, I have harina right here. I'll heat up. What do you want in your tortilla? I'll just do. I the, forgot uh, to make the salsa. No, I'll just do the, uh, the green guac. Yeah, the crema. Okay. Do you want some cheese on your shrimp? Yeah. Do you want me to grade that? Or? Yes. I love my little electric skillet. It's perfect for two people. melted butter. We had a nice evening. We Very had cool. shrimp and we zucchini some camera on tacos. And shared some with a neighbor. Yeah. yeah. Guy from or uh, Washington. And then uh and our friends John and Teresa and a couple hosted other. Us over there. Yeah. So we yes. just chatted with the neighborhood peeps yes. here at Cocos. Had Always a great nice. evening. Always and now, I don't think there's a moon tonight, but the stars are starting to, They're starting to pop. pop. <laughs> and tomorrow's supposed to be a calm day, so we are going to get out there. Go kayaking. And snorkeling, too. I think you need to snorkel. Mm. We'll get you over there. There's I think some really Rich good needs fish. to snorkel and Robin needs to relax. relax. Or, you know what, Robin? You need to do some videos. <laughs> <laughs> need to get this video posted. Get them up there. Okay. Get them up there. Throw okay. them up there. Buenas noches. Buenas noches. Goodbye, Los Cocos. We'll see you soon. Are we retiring to Mexico? Well, Robin, it sounds appealing. We have been here a lot. And but on our next to... trip, we're going to check out some places that we may want may to wanna purchase in the future. But there's so many places we want to go. Well, it's not. we can have a home base yes. around Concepcion. And then just go south every once in a while in the van. Yep. The best of both worlds. In our next video, we take the two-day drive north to cross the border. Along the way, we share how much we spent in Baja for three weeks in our van. Adios. Adios, amigos.